Hi, yogis. This is just a general flow for whenever you need just a few moments of yoga. We're actually going to begin standing. So when you're ready, please come to the top of the mat, bring your hands together in prayer. Close your eyes for just a moment, full breath in. And full breath out. With nice strong legs, reach the arms out and on and up. Good, exhale, fold in half. Inhale, a half lift, long spine, and abs and fold. And strong legs come back up. And exhale, hands and heart. Good, full breath in. And full breath out. Good, repeating, inhale. Exhale, fold. Inhale, a half lift. And exhale, fold. And really strong legs. It kind of fuels the practice here. Engaging. Good. Release. Last time. Inhale. Exhale. Fold. Inhale. A half lift. Exhale. Fold. Good. Strong active legs that will help you rise. And exhale. Hands to the heart. Good. Take a full breath in. Full breath out. Good. Inhale, sweep the arms up. Exhale, hinge. Inhale, long spine. Exhale, please. Nice big full breath in. And this time, lower to the knees. And as you breathe out, slowly lower all the way down. Roll your shoulders open and back. Slide your hands to their more mid rib cage. Lift that cobra. Exhale, forward and down. Tuck your toes and press yourself back to child's pose. Take a full breath in. And full breath out. Good. Inhale and exhale. Find down. Good. Heels lift. Knees are soft. Exhale, feet to hands. Inhale, a half lift. Exhale, fold. Strong legs come up. Exhale, hands and prayer. Okay, inhale. Exhale, fold. Inhale, a half lift. Exhale, back to plank pose. Now you can drop your knees or keep the legs long as you lower. Great cobra. And down dog. Good, full breath in. Full breath out. Good, again, full breath in, and full breath out. Lift your heels, soften your knees, bring your feet to the hands, find a half lift through your ride. Fold forward, strong legs come up. Exhale, hands together. Good, inhale. Exhale, fold. Inhale, long spine. Exhale, plank. Full breath. Exhale, lower to the floor. Your cobra, strong, active legs to support the lifting of the chest. Exhale, down, down. Full breath in. Full breath out. And then full breath in. And full breath out. Okay, lift your heels, soften your knees. Step your feet up to the hands. Find a half lift and fold. Strong legs rise. Yeah, exhale, hands together. Good. Continue on. Inhale. Exhale, fold. Inhale, a half lift. Exhale, you can step or float yourself back. You can move through. Chaturanga to up dog. Exhale. Good, full breath in, and full breath out, and full breath in, and full breath out. Good, inhale, lift your heels, soften your knees, exhale, step or float your feet up to your hands, take a half lift, and fold, strong legs rise. 
Exhale, hips back. Good, inhale. Exhale, fold. Inhale, a half lift. Exhale, step or float your way back. Coming through, chaturanga to up dog or floor to cobra. Finding your way back. You can keep both feet neutral or sweep your right leg up. You can bend your knee and roll your hip open. Good, full breath in. And full breath out. Last one, full breath in. And full breath out. Good, inhale. And then as you exhale, square your hips, look forward. Step your right foot forward. Drop the left knee down, sweep your arms up, breathing in. Good, exhale, hands to the floor, shift your weight back and stretch your front leg straight. Good, inhale, breathe out the front knee. Opening up through the chest and exhale, stretch the leg straight. Good, inhale. And exhale. Last time, inhale. And exhale. Good, inhale, knee bends. Come back to down. Good, inhale, plank. Exhale, lower. Inhale. And exhale. Good, left leg lifts, inhale. Bend your knee, roll the hip open. Good, full breath in. Full breath out. Full breath in. And full breath out. Last full breath in. Exhale, hips neutral, look forward. Step the left foot forward between the hands. Wiggle the right toes back, drop the knee, lift the arms up. Good, hands to the floor, shift your weight back. Coming to Ardha Hanuman. Inhale, front knee bends. And exhale, shift back. Good, inhale, come forward. And exhale, stretch the legs straight. Twice more, inhale. And exhale. Good, last time, inhale. And exhale. Good, inhale, front knee bends. Step it back, plank, full breath. Lower down through Chaturanga. Up dog. Down dog. Just pause. Full breath in. Good. Inhale. Heels lift. Knees soft. Exhale. Step or float your feet up forward between the hands. Take a half lift and fold. Strong legs rise up. Exhale. Hands at the heart. Full breath in. And full breath out. Good. Bend your knees and reach your arms up. Chair pose. Good. Exhale. Fold. Inhale. Half lift. Exhale, step or float it back. Coming to Chaturanga, up dog, down dog. Bend your left foot at 45 degrees. Step your right foot forward and rise up for your one. Good, full breath in, full breath out. Let the natural rhythm of the breath kind of match the natural rhythm of the body, right? There's a, just a little bit of movement that's, that's kind of inherent here. So kind of feel into that last full breath. Exhale, hands come, they frame the front foot. You can come back through the yasa, or if at any point you want to quickly come to down dog, feel free. Good, right foot plants, left foot is forward. Rise up, warrior one. Good, just letting the body simply find its natural rhythm with the breath. Strong, active back leg for your support system. Good, last breath. As you exhale, hands bring the front foot, coming back through your vinyasa, or simply bind it down and breathing. Here, lift your heels, soften your knees, look forward, step your right foot forward, plant your back foot, find your warrior two. Take a nice big full breath in. Stretch your front leg straight and come into Trikonasana, triangle pose. Strong active legs, press the feet down and away. 
option to take that left arm long overhead. Good, last breath. Inhale, come back to your warrior two. Good, exhale, hands come, they frame your front foot. Yogi's choice, come through your vinyasa or come right to down dog and pause. Good, inhale, heels lift, knees are soft. Look forward as you exhale, send your left foot forward, ground the right foot, come back through your warrior two. Good, last breath. And then stretch your front leg straight, coming into Trikonasana. Good, the legs are strong and active, the feet press down and away. Feel free to take the right arm overhead. Let the bicep be parallel to the ear. Good, inhale, come back up through warrior two. Exhale, hands come, they frame your front foot and take your vinyasa or come right to down. Good. Inhale, heels lift, knees soft. Exhale, step or float your feet up between the hands. Take a half lift when you arrive. And fold forward, breathe out. The chair pose, Utkatasana. Arms are up, full breath in. Exhale, lower. And we'll just kind of stay. So you can have the hands in prayer, or you can keep the arms up. Yogi's choice, just holding on the chair for another moment. Full breath in. Good, full breath out. Good, inhale, all the way to skin. And then exhale, take your hands, interlace them together behind you as one. Lift the chest. And then soften through the knees and fold forward. You can begin to stretch your legs straight if you'd like. Nice long spine, elongating the hamstrings, getting into the calves. Good, re-bend the knees, come back to chair pose, full breath in. And exhale, stand. Good, from here, inhale, arms up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, your half lift. Exhale, you can step or float the feet back. You can lower down to the floor for cobra. You can screw chaturanga to up dog. Coming back to down dog. Go ahead and float your right leg up. Inhale. Exhale, look forward. Step the right foot forward. And then bring your back foot down for a warrior two stance. Come on up for just a moment. And come in a side angle. So you can do forearm to thigh. Left arm up. If you want, you can take the right hand to the floor to a block if you have one. And option to stretch that left arm long overhead. So we press the feet down and away from each other. We lengthen through the inner thighs. Good, last breath. And slowly let the hands come and frame your front foot, your hips pivot. You can take a vinyasa or come right to down. Good, inhale, lift your left leg up. Exhale, look forward, shift your weight forward, left foot between the hands, right foot pivots, you're gonna rise your warrior two. Hinge, take your side angle, you form to thigh or hand outside. Good, option to stretch that right arm long overhead. So when you press your feet down and away, it creates length beginning right at the hip. So we engage and elongate. Good, last breath. Let the hands come and frame your front foot. Hips are neutral. And from here, just go ahead and step that right leg up, bring it behind the left and come to a seat. Okay, so stretch that right leg forward and bend the left knee and bring the foot right along the inner thigh. You can hook your thumbs and have your arms up. Good, exhale, forward fold. Good, just letting the spine naturally round. Good, inhale, come on up. And we'll switch, so opposite leg long. Hook your thumbs and stretch your arms up. 
good and fold forward. Good, last breath. Inhale, come on up. Good, hands behind just for a little support. Cross at your shins and find yourself back and down. Good, so from down dog, reach your right leg up. As you exhale, look forward, set the right foot forward. Come back to the warrior two stance. Good, so you just have a really nice kind of solid foundation here. Heel toe the back foot in maybe once or twice. Find your tree and So coming back to triangle pose. Good, nice, strong, active leg. Now when you take your left hand to your left uh, hip, look down, bend your front knee, take your right fingertips to the right corner of your mat, shift forward, maybe just slide that left foot in for a moment, and then lift the left leg up, coming into half moon. Good, option to stretch your left arm up as well. Option to take poet's pose. So if you're taking poet's pose, bend a little deeper into the right knee, lift the right arm up, and come into that half prayer. And last breath. If you've got poets, release. Open up one more time. And then I want you to simply let that left hand come to the floor and pivot your hips so they come to neutral. Bend your left knee and drop that knee outside the right foot, coming down into Ardha Matsi and Drasana. So reach the left arm up, full breath. And exhale, take your choice. Good, breathing fully and deeply here. Last breath. And slowly release. Let your hands come back and frame your front foot. Step it back to down dog. You can always get a vinyasa in between here if you'd like. Good, and stretch your left leg up in half. Exhale, left foot forward between your hands. Rise up to your warrior two. Good. And then if you have a knife on stance, you can heel toe the back foot in once or twice. Find triangle pose, find your trikonasana. Good. And then take the right hand to the hip. Look forward. Look down. Bend your left knee. Begin to shift your weight forward a little bit and let your right leg sit. You can have both hands engaged down for a little bit more support and balance or right on the hip. And again, if you want to take poet's pose, Bend a little bit into that left leg for a support system and just come to that half prayer position. Good, last breath, both hands down. Look down, square the hips so you're nice and neutral. Bend your right knee and bring that leg outside the left foot. And so coming down to the seat. Inhale, right arm is up. And as you exhale, you're gonna rotate through the rib cage. Right arm, you can either hug in or right arm comes up. Try okay. Good, one last breath. And slowly release. Good, from here. From here, bring the soles of the feet together. Take the hands to the front of the ankles. Lift the chest. Good, and then fold, coming into body. Giving the low back a little TLC. And then press the heels together, come on up, roll the shoulders open and back, and then come all the way down. So coming down onto the back, just let the knees hug in for a moment, and then put the feet on the floor. Arms long by your sides. Inhale, coming up to the bridge. And we'll stay for just a few breaths here. So really tapping into the hamstrings, the glutes. And breathing fully into both lungs. Letting the exhale maybe be longer than the inhale. So even though we're working, we're asking a lot of the body we're kind of mediating that with the breath. So full breath in, and then elongate the exhale. 
that last breath. And you can slowly lower it. And then take your arms out into a T. Let the knees draw in. You can rock a little side to side. And then the next time you rock the knees to the right, go ahead and find yourself in the twist. You can take your right hand to the top leg and just kind of hold for a moment. back to center and drop the leg to the other side make sure they're supported by the floor by each other you can always tuck a blanket or pillow between or underneath just kind of let go and release any holding the low back and take one more breath and slowly release, come back. And just plant your left foot on the floor, reach your right leg up. You can take your hands and interlace behind the thigh for a moment. Just press that right leg forward. Good, and then when you're ready, if you want, you can stretch the left leg long. You keep the hands where they are, bring more to the calf or more to the foot just to get a little hamstring action here. Just really activate those through the left leg. So I want you to press the left leg bones down and then flex the left foot. Good, and then hug the right knee in. Put the right foot on the floor. And stretch your left leg long. Interlace the hands behind the thigh and just press that leg forward for a moment. Kind of clearing out the low back here. Good, and then option to stretch your right leg long and keep the hands where they are. Move into the calf, bring it to the foot. And really anchor down through the right leg, off of the shoulders. And then hug that leg in. Good. Okay. And for just a moment, bring the soles of the feet together. Let the knees be wide. You can take arms overhead, maybe clasp opposite elbows if you'd like. Around the body to be. And then release the arms and Stretch your legs long one at a time. Just let the feet kind of flop open and close. Let them flop into the open position, palms facing up as well. Slowly come back to the body and the breath. Maybe simply begin by letting the feet flop in and out. Maybe you'll stretch the arms long overhead and grow here. And eventually bend both knees, put the feet on the floor, and find a side to roll to. Find yourself back in seat. Once you arrive, just let the eyes close. Bring your hands together at the heart. Now take a nice big full breath in through the nose, pause and hold. Open the mouth and let it go. Namaste. 
thank you all for being here. Have a beautiful day or night. <laughs> all right, let's hope they all came out. <laughs>